In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a downline relationship graph, just like this one here. With the CRM and AllPro web tools, it's possible to keep a record of which one of your contacts referred a new client to you. In order to do this, you will need the CRM web tool, which you can add by going to Settings and Web Tools. Then go to the Available Web Tools button and scroll down until you find CRM and click Add. And now you have the CRM tool installed. To show how to keep track of referrals, first I'm going to add a new contact by clicking the Add button on the top menu and selecting Contact. Now just like with any other contact, I'm going to go ahead and fill out some of the information here. Now that I have the information filled in, I'm going to take a look at this Referred By field. All I have to do is start typing the name of a contact that is already in my CRM. A drop-down will appear, allowing me to select a specific contact. Now when I create the record for Eugene, it's also going to be connected to Earl's record, showing that Earl referred Eugene to me. We can see what this looks like after I click Save. And in the box that says Contact Information, I'm going to go over to the far right, where there's a button that looks like a tree graph. I'll click on this, and we can see right here that Eugene had been referred by Earl. Now I'm going to go ahead and click on Earl's name here so that we can look at his CRM record. And I'm going to go to that same button on the far right of the contact information. And now we can take a look at Earl's graph. We can see that Earl has actually referred three clients to me, Levi, Tall, and Eugene. I can also see that Earl was not referred to me by anybody. However, I know that is a mistake. I know for a fact Earl was referred to me by somebody, but it probably forgot to put it in. So I'm going to go up to this box that says Downline and start typing in the name of the person that referred Earl to me. The dropdown appeared, and I can select the contact. And now the graph is updated, showing to me that Christopher referred Earl, and in return, Earl referred three more contacts to me.